at DZMikeTV.com, right here with Gary Antoine Russell. Hey, the press conference, Gary, how you doing? Wonderful, man. Thanks for asking. No problem, no problem. Now, last Just time I... getting ready for the 20th, that's all. Absolutely. Last time I talked to you, I think it was in, what, February? At uh, Jared Hurst Gym, and you supposed to fought uh, back in March, but obviously your brother's uh, opponent injured yeah, his back, so got postponed. So, how's it feel fighting here at the new MGM Grand? How's it... What do you think of the arena? And just talk to them. I'm more excited that it's home. Mm -hmm. You know, I've been <clears throat> away during my amateur career to all these foreign places: mm -hmm. Azerbaijan, Argentina, Morocco, and Brazil. You know, I've been just traveling. It's been a journey, but now that I'm stationary and I'm fighting on the same car with my brothers, man, I'm excited. I'm very excited to be honest. Mm. So does it relax you a little bit more, Ben? Though you're fighting alongside with your brothers. It oh, definitely yeah. does. It definitely does. It, it, it feels like I'm in my territory. Although wherever I go, I feel like I'm in my territory. Right, right. But it's I'm more well grounded, home. So yeah, I feel a lot more comfortable. Absolutely. So what do you think about um your other brother, uh, An uh Gary Antonio? Ant Antonio. Yeah, Antonio. He's with seven and zero, uh, five knockouts. Yes, yes, yes. His pro debut. He had knockout of the year. Mm -hmm. uh, he, Gonna keep it going. Absolutely. You know, he's gonna go eight and no, I believe. Absolutely. You know, he got the talent, he got the ability, he got the ring generalship, mm -hmm. and etc. He's shopping in his tools. He's man been practicing for nobody but this guy. Right, right. And we are very astute of the game, of the sport, period. Mm -hmm. So I'm, I'm most certain that he's going to come out victorious. You know, and he's going to get you an action-packed fight because the guy he's going against, he's not looking forward to just laying down. Mm -hmm. You know, but we, we're going to make a way to make him lay down. Right, right. And you know, that's what we train for. That's what we design for. We warriors. But please do not forget we're not just jocks, man. Boxing is what we do, but does it define who we are? Mm. So stay tuned to Antonio Russell as well. Absolutely. And obviously, your brother's fighting Escondon. Escondon is kind of short. Um, you know, how was training camp for all you guys? Not just yourself or your brother. How was training camp for all you guys? Obviously, everybody says, you know, training camp goes well. You move your head, you can slip, you pivot. But a lot of times, fighters look good in training. Not trying to say that you guys don't. You guys look well in training as well as fight night. You, you get what I'm trying to say? I get exactly what you're trying to say. A lot of people feel more comfortable in their backyard. <clears throat> when they get taken out of their comfort zone, things tend to change. Uh, training camp has been very well. I've weighed the magnitude of how good it's been from how much we get cussed out, how much we get fussed, like my brother said. Uh, haven't been a lot of fussing. Haven't been too much adjusting. You know, the majority of it been on our endurance and our intellect. Being able to see what our opponent is doing. Being able to make the adjustments on the fly ourselves. Because normally people will wait for their corner man or their coach to say, hey, do this. Hey, he's doing this, so I need you to move to his left hand side. We got to do that ourselves because a lot of times it can be too loud for you to even hear your coach. Mm. And you're not always going to be able to fall back on his word. You're going to have to take action yourself right then and there at the heat of the moment. So we've been, we've been practicing that, you know, and we've been coming out strong on that. Right, right. I was, yeah, May 20th. Training camp been amazing. Okay, okay. Obviously May 20th.